just a poor boy, though my story is seldom told. I have squandered my resistance for a pocket full of mumbles, such a promises. All lies and jest, still man hears what he wants to hear and disregards the rest. Kepareng matur, nami kulo Ari Wicaksono, kulo sak meniko matur ngagem boso jawi. Boso ingkang dipun agem tumrap sedan tentiang, wonten ing tanah jawi, Indonesia. I left my country when I was 16. I was lucky to get a scholarship from my dad's American employer. This way I could go to high school in the United States and do my bachelor degree in environmental studies there. After that, I came back home. But without any work experience and network, it was hard to get a job in Indonesia. My father had died in the meantime, and my family decided to sell the house, so I could continue my studies in Germany. Unfortunately, that money did not last long, so in order for me to finish my studies, we also had to sell our car. I think Germany is a good place to study, but somehow I always felt like It is not really the place where I fit in. I don't know. Maybe it has to do something with the cold weather in Germany or with my Japanese background which is very different from the German mindset. Then I'm laying out my winter clothes and wishing I was gone, going home. Where the cold German winters are not bleeding me. Bleeding me. I decided to come back home and work in Indonesia. Plus, I always wanted to give my community something back and use the know-how I had gained abroad in my own country. In the beginning, I worked for the Clean Badik Initiative, which was funded by the European Union. Badik plays a very important role in Java, yet its production has a lot of negative effects on the environment. Sometimes you can see rivers change their color from blue to red to brown in one day, depending on what color the close by batik producer just used. My assignment in the Clean Batik Initiative was to make the production more efficient and environmental friendly. For example, through saving water and using less chemicals. A better health protection for workers was another aim. Today, I work as an advisor for the provincial government of Yogyakarta in Java. My assignment is to improve the institutional performance in the Department of Economy and Natural Resources. I support the staff in developing new capacities and ideas. To give you an example, one of the policies that we brought up lately is to promote local products. We are trying to bring more local goods on supermarket shelves. But we also want to improve the infrastructure of traditional markets. Kami ingin pemberdayaan peningkatan uh, pengetahuan sumber daya manusia yang ada di kami dilakukan oleh uh, lokal. Karena tetapi dia sudah pernah mengikuti pendidikan internasional supaya mempunyai wawasan yang lebih luas tetapi bisa lebih uh, familiar, akrab dengan SDM kami. Tetapi kalau dengan teman sendiri yang lokal, tapi dia sudah pernah ke internasional, dia akan lebih mudah, mudah menerima. I found both of these work opportunities through the German Returning Experts Program. The advisor of the program in Indonesia has supported me a lot to settle down after my return. Without him, I probably would not have found a job where I feel like I can really make a difference. And in addition to my local salary, I also get a financial support from the German program. Of course, it was another incentive for me to come back home and engage in the development of my country. All in all, I spent almost nine years abroad for my education and I'm grateful for this experience. Yet there is nothing they can compare to having my favorite chicken soup at sunrise on the streets of my hometown Yogyakarta. There is no place like home, or as the Japanese say, 
Boten wonten papan panggonan ingkang langkung nyaman kejawi dalemipun piyamba. In the clearing stands a boxer and a fighter by his train And he carries the reminder of every glove that led him the torcut Till him he cried out in his anger and his shame I am leaving, I am leaving, but the fighter still remains 